By the end of this video, we will be able to understand the vertebrates and invertebrates. Before going into details, kindly subscribe our channel so you don't miss these interesting factual videos. Animals have mainly two categories, the vertebrates and invertebrates. Vertebrates Vertebrates are animals with backbones. They can be classified according to their features and include bony fish, amphibians, reptiles, birds, and mammals. Bony fish Bony fish absorb oxygen through their gills and they have wet scales. Their body temperature varies according to their surroundings. Organisms that do this are called poikilotherms. Bony fish reproduce by external fertilization and lay eggs, they are oviparous. Amphibians Amphibians usually have lungs, but they can also absorb oxygen through their moist skin. Their body temperature also varies according to their surroundings. Amphibians also reproduce by external fertilization and lay eggs. Reptiles Reptiles have lungs and dry scales. As with bony fish and amphibians, their body temperature varies according to their surroundings. However, reptiles reproduce by internal fertilization and lay eggs. Birds Birds have lungs, feathers, and beaks. They can maintain their body temperature. Organisms that do this are called homeotherms. Like reptiles, birds reproduce by internal fertilization and lay eggs. Mammals Mammals have lungs and fur. Like birds, they can maintain their body temperature. Mammals reproduce by internal fertilization and they give birth to live young, they are viviparous. Invertebrates Invertebrates are animals without backbones. They include annelids, nematodes, mollusks, and arthropods. Annelids Annelids are segmented worms with soft bodies. Most of the worm's body consists of identical segments, giving it a ringed appearance. Nematodes Nematodes are tiny, thin worms without segments. Many species are free-living, but others are parasites that cause disease. For example, hookworms can infect humans. Mollusks Mollusks usually have a broad muscular foot and may also have a shell. Examples of mollusks include snails, slugs, squids, and octopuses. Arthropods Arthropods are an important phylum of invertebrates. They have a hard exoskeleton, their skeleton is on the outside rather than on the inside. A segmented body, their body has different sections. Jointed legs. Thanks for watching. To learn more, just visit and subscribe our YouTube channel. Link in description.